to finally, see you. Finally. Finally. <laughs> I should have worn my special sweatshirt. No, the one I wore at the Australian. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there your special small health in the new sweatshirt? I wouldn't see that. Thank you. It's a little bit about much. It was a little bit difficult because it was windy, but um, I'm really pleased with the way I played. I think I played the smart tennis and um, yeah, I've been focused and I moved pretty well. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? <laughs> um, so, congratulations on the win. Thank you. Um, obviously, yeah, the win tonight uh, seemed to be at times at a level that could be very, very frustrating for you guys, but you seem to manage it quite well. Um, what was the key tonight to just managing the conditions to be able to play as cleanly as you did? Um, yeah, I'm not scared about the wind. Uh, I never been also when I was a kid. Um, as I said, I think I played smart tonight because from one side you had to play different, from the other side a little bit different. So I think I managed very well all the, the moments. I got a little bit frustrated some at some points because I missed some balls that were super, super easy. But, you know, it happens and it was for both of us difficult. So um, I just wanted to stay focused on actually what I thought before the match that I have to do. And I did it 100% right. Earlier in the week, in similar conditions, Sloan and Naomi had said it was the windiest match they'd ever played. Do you remember the windiest match that you've ever had to play in? It's tough. <laughs> it's tough because many times uh, you play in the wind. I think in Dubai, I, I played once, like 2015 night, I think, yeah, against Kanepi, if I'm not wrong. Uh, it was yeah disaster. <laughs> we couldn't even the, the ball was moving until you know the touch did the second part of the court. Yeah, it was really really tough. So Mona, you'll you'll face Serana next, and you guys have not played almost at all on tour. This would be the first match in almost 12 years. Yeah, um, which is weird because. <laughs> I mean, you know, you're both veterans. I played with many Romanians. Yes, <laughs> yeah. yeah, Serana's just not one of them. But what, what's the challenge of facing her? Do you guys practice very much at all? or? Uh, we did uh, lately a few times, but not very much. Um, well, I cannot say anything because we didn't play. So um, it's going to be a big challenge uh, for me. Uh, it's just another match. I'm used to play with Romanians. Uh, of course, it's going to be a tough one. She's a great player. So I'm just looking forward uh, for the day off tomorrow, and uh, I will think about the match after. I'm curious with your new coaching setup. You were saying the other day it's weird to have a coach that's younger than you. Yeah. Um, how does that work? Because like, if you go tonight and you play golf, or you know, you play Saran or players, do you go to that match with your own scouting report? Like just your experience, you know what to do? Does he have that input? Because you are a very experienced player, obviously. On the tour. Oh, I am. I can say I am. Uh, but if he's in my team, means that I'm talking to him. So uh, we do a plan uh, before the matches. We talk um, what I should do, what I have to do. So the whole team from the, this academy is great to me. And uh, I really enjoy the time that I'm spending with them. And um, yeah, looks good so far. So um, yeah, I'm looking forward actually to get to know him better because it's only 10 days, 15, yeah, 12 days together. So I cannot say much, but um, I feel good. Earlier, Iga talked about the difficulty of focusing on your own game if you have too detailed a scouting report about your opponent. How do you balance what you want to know about your opponent and how you focus on doing your best as yourself? Well, I think we know each other now for so many years. Um, it's not that I'm focusing on the opponent when I'm playing. I'm focusing more on myself, uh, so I don't struggle with that. Um, of course, before the match, uh, you talk with uh, your team about how she's playing lately or what she has better, what she doesn't have that, uh, that good. But I think all the players are super good in this level. So you have mostly to, to focus on yourself and to try to do your best every time you step on the court. So I think, yeah, it's more about you than the opponent. Any more questions? Good. <laughs> Thank you, Seymour.